Xiaomi announces their new trash HDMI 2.1 MIQ1 TV with supposedly a 120Hz panel just without the 120Hz support. So Xiaomi announced this TV that's supposed to be geared towards budget gamers and in its marketing it says it has a 120Hz display and HDMI 2.1 support and it's a 4K resolution. So logically, you'd think you'd be able to play games at 4K 120Hz. Well, you'd be sadly mistaken because they just took out the 120Hz part. You see, the input will be limited to 60Hz, but technically it's 120Hz so that they can market it as a 120Hz display. You know, it's just a scummy marketing tactic. It'll also use a feature called MEMC, which is motion estimation motion compensation to artificially double the frame rate. And the thing is with this feature is it's known for its latency to the scenes and for adding something that's called the soap opera effect. And most people just disable it because it's complete garbage. So the reason for them to get rid of the 120 hertz feature is because they say it's some hardware limitation that prevents the TV from receiving and then displaying the 4K 120Hz content. Nobody knows what the limitation is because they don't say, but I guess it is what it is. So if you look at the specs alone, it looks pretty impressive. It's got a 75 inch QLED panel and it has a peak brightness of 1000 nits. And it covers 95% of the DCI-P3 color gamut. Also, it's an 8-bit panel with FRC, frame rate control, and a 10,000 to 1 contrast ratio. So it offers three HDMI 2.1 inputs, but the thing is, none of them can receive 4K 120Hz. All ports support enhanced audio return channel and auto low latency mode. Console gamers will appreciate these features, but they won't appreciate the lack of HDMI 2.1 support on their HDMI 2.1 TV. So they say that this is going to be available soon for 1300 euros, which converts to 1556 US dollars. All in all, it's probably going to be a good monitor other than the lack of 120 hertz support, but I would not recommend getting this thing because of the scummy marketing and it's probably going to jack up the price just because they can say it's HDMI 2.1. Anyways, like the video and subscribe to the channel if you like this type of content.